Hey guys, Ultimate Noob here, back with another video, and today we're gonna be talking about Respawn releasing some new patch notes that are gonna be live in the game this week. They're not live yet, they're gonna be released somewhere along the next seven days, okay? So basically, they're gonna be talking about audio fixes, performance fixes, quality of life improvements, hit detection fixes, bug fixes, and lots more. Okay, so let's get into it. Sorry to deviate slightly off topic here, but I want to welcome all of the new subscribers to the channel and I want to thank all of you for subscribing as well. I hope you enjoy all the content that I put out on this channel. I will be uploading regularly, I will be streaming regularly. So if you guys want to get games in with me, just drop into my stream, put in your PSN, drop a like or something. So up, we have the audio fixes. So Respawn have come out and said their biggest issue was to tackle improving audio performance to address issues reported of sound dropping out sound missing from extended time or distortion from a period of time so what this means is they're fixing the problem where when you have more than three enemies around you shooting at each other and you're shooting at them you get this sound distortion which basically causes you to want to kill yourself because of how bad the audio starts sounding because it's so static and it's so delayed so that's a major fix because that causes a lot of irritation with players. And another thing that they've said is they've increased the volume of footsteps. This is going to have major impacts in close quarters combat, guys, because you're going to know now where somebody is around you when they're close by because they said that footsteps can be heard even in gunfights now. That is huge. All right. So... The next thing that they've introduced is quality of life improvements. And I'm just going to read these out because these are like really simple and you, you guys will be able to understand this. So they've lowered the master volume of all sounds during the character select screen through the end of the drop sequence. So we can basically talk to each other when we're selecting characters now because before you couldn't even hear your, what your teammate was saying unless they had their mic volume on max and that would basically split your ears which was really annoying. Moving on, they lowered the volume of rate ambient kunai knife sound. Okay, okay, nobody nobody wants to hear this because, well, who the fuck has kunai anyway? I don't have it. Like, if you respawn, you want to hook me up with that shit? Like, I'll be up for it. Anyway, like, barely anyone has kunai. Next up, we have, they've increased the volume of close proximity enemy footsteps for all legends. I've just talked about that. Slightly lowered the volume of Pathfinder's footsteps heard from first person view interesting they've increased the volume of the music that plays when winning a match so i guess they want to make us feel like we've actually accomplished something when we win this time i don't think that that changes much anyway and they've added more detail audio into training missions i don't think anyone gives a shit about that hit detection fixes and improvements these are the changes we actually give a shit about basically what they're talking about in this is they've Push some fixes that should eliminate many cases of incorrect hit detection. This patch also includes some behind the scenes tracking of bullet damage logic. They expect that there will be some remaining hit registration problems but they will fix these with diagnostic information when they are better equipped to take them down. All right. Next up, they have a one, one potential cause of hit registration bugs according to them can be simple internet connection problems. In order to determine this, this is fun, this is a fun factor, um, they've, put some, they've put some time into refining the functionality behind their network problems, and they've introduced, they're gonna be introducing indicator icons on the upper right side of the screen, and the icons are pick here now about your internet connection quality, which will show up more frequently than they did before. So it's basically the, uh, the ping on the upper right side of your screen that shows you when you time out. That's going to be appearing more often now when your internet quality is choppy. Which will basically indicate that it's not a problem with the game for hit registration, it's your internet connection. Another patch that they've in introduced is not a big one, it's uh, Lifeline's Pick Me Up banner bug on PS4. Basically what they've said is this issue has been resolved and they will be re-enabling the banner after the patch is live. Additional bug fixes and changes include fixed issues. Additional bug fixes and changes include 45 passive ability for Gibraltar and Caustic, where they would take damage through shields. 
They've also fixed the bug that allowed players to stick objects to Gibraltar's gun shield. So no more sticking your octane jump pad on it, no more grappling to it, none of that bullshit now anymore. Although the Gibraltar's gun shield can now de deflect arc stars, so that's interesting. And that's pretty much it. Guys, I feel like Respawn are taking a step in the right direction. They're listening to the community, they're listening to what we have to say. Basically, they give a shit about us, and now we know that they give a shit about us. So I feel like we should keep voicing our opinion on this game. And I feel like this game has the potential to be way better and get a way larger player basis than it already has. And it has um, the potential to be back on top. Anyway, let me know what you guys think of these patches in the comments below. And please stick around for the rest of the video because this video is actually a 20 bomb that I've dropped like a couple of days ago. And you guys might just like my reaction towards the end. And stick around and thank you for sticking around to towards the end of the video, guys. Oh, they're all I'll so see beam. You later. Peace out. Enough run. Ah, oh, fuck, another squad. Okay, I've got two so far. My kill, my kill, my kill, my kill. Alright, my finish those yeah, yeah, finish those guys up. Mike, I'm coming back up, I'm coming back up. Where are they where's the guy with shooting at you? Where's the guy shooting at you? Four more, four more, four more. Let me check out here. I hear him, I hear him. I got him, I got him, I got him. Oh, it's one guy. I have to kill the whole last squad. I have to kill the whole last squad, guys. No, no, don't, don't kill him, don't kill him, don't kill him. You guys can die from him. Where is he? I can't, I can't, I don't have an angle on him. I don't have an angle on him. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Don't kill him, don't kill him, don't kill him, don't kill him. Yeah, let's go! Woo! Let's go! Another 20 bomb, baby, let's go! Ah, post birthday present, motherfuckers, let's go! Woo! I had it coming, let's go, yeah! Woo! Oh shit, the street sounds at 400, let's go, motherfuckers, let's go! Bro, my octane, my octane's fucking shit's complete. The fucking badge is complete, let's go.